Good evening. Welcome to the Selectmen's meeting for August 5th, 2019. Um, my board roll call, please. Wayne Miller present. Sulicio is present. Um, call the meeting to order. Pledge of Allegiance, please. Pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, and indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I would like to, um, to ask, just because it's the first time that we've met since these last two tragedies, um, just to um, take a moment of silence and think about the victims and the horrible things that that happened in the last couple of days and hopefully um, we'll find a solution and that won't happen as often. Okay, 1.3, Chairman's additions or deletions, I have none. Um, public comment period, I'm gonna just forego that one for this meeting because we only have one little thing. Do you guys wanna um, call your meeting to order? Yeah, I'd like to call the Water Commission meeting to order uh, August 5th, 2019 in the Selectman like meeting room. Uh, roll call. Nathan Madela present. Todd Melanson present. Michael McCackin present. Thank you. Um, 2.1 joint meeting with the Board of Water Commissioners regarding recommendation slash vote to contract or hire an interim water superintendent. Mike, I'm going to turn to you. How'd you make out? I talked to Jim today, and all we really got is the um, Weston and Sampson and that um, cook lady that Jim knows a little more about it. Uh, Jer um Weston and Sampson is a private contract operator that does contract operations on an interim basis with communities. Um, Barbara Cook referred it off to her division head. Um, they're not certain that they have staffing to be able to provide us coverage because they've had retirements. Uh, he's supposed to get back to Mike uh, and I tomorrow. Um, but. Um, consistent with what you and I discussed a little earlier, perhaps having something as a motion in the back pocket of the chair of the Water Commission. Um, Speak up, please. I can't hear. Okay, do you want to move up closer? Well, I, I second that. It's hard to, it's difficult to hear. Okay. What, what I was saying is there, Weston and Sampson is the group that was, the group that was being directed to be spoken to as of the last meeting. They've indicated that they may not be able to provide staff to provide assistance because they've had retirements. So they're supposed to get back tomorrow. What I added to that was, as I discussed with the chair earlier today, I think it'd be wise to have a vote of both boards authorizing the chair of the commission to be able to continue to reach out and find somebody in the interim um, without having to have another week or two go by before the boards are able to meet again. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and in that sense, you'd be able to engage someone and then we could ratify yeah, absolutely. Yeah. at our next meeting. Yeah. Okay. Todd, you had your hand up? Yeah. Um, I'd rather it be a vote of our board and not just the chairman. Um, I, I think it's something that we as a board should have as a group have input on um, um, there are other contractors beyond Weston and Sampson that do the same thing um, I have multiple contacts um, I didn't know that Mike was doing that um, um, I think it's something that well there was nothing I was doing except what well, we you talked just, about you did, well, but, but yes. that's something you should have no let, no hold on no, hold yeah, time hold out on. time out okay <laughs> And the reason I'm saying time out is Mike is right. That is exactly what we talked about last week. And to tell you the truth, I'm disappointed because I said, I'm going to leave it to you guys to try to figure it out and come with a recommendation to us tonight. All right? Um, now, no, no. After what happened this past week, 
I'm going to be honest with you, you're lucky I'm still here. What happened? I don't want to talk <laughs> about anything that isn't on this agenda. So, all right, so we'll keep to the agenda. You asked if it's a board. I think it needs to be a water a group, not just okay. the chairman. Do you have the ability to meet and to post, first of all, okay, it's, it doesn't, it doesn't qualify as an emergency meeting. Right. That's the first thing, okay? My suggestion, if that is what you really want to do, is for you to go back tomorrow and post for us to, for you guys to have a meeting every single day for the rest of this week. Yeah, or every single day, because how are you going to have these discussions amongst yourself yeah. without well, violating the open meeting law? They could hold this meeting open, Madam Chair. They could actually postpone this meeting to a time so certain, that time being. I I instead of having to repost. One second, Nate. Mr. Chairman. And and so but they would it wouldn't end up being a, a full board on our side. If I understand. It's, this is a joint meeting. Right. We're posted Todd, as a joint meeting. Right. If I understand Todd correctly, what he's saying is the Board of Water Commissioners not just the chair should be involved in selecting what contractor or person comes forward. That's fine. So if they hold their meeting tonight open until, and say, each night of the week, and Todd has contacts that he makes, and, and Mike has some, and Nate has some, and they come together tomorrow night, and they compare their notes, and they make a decision, they then notify the select board. 48 hours from there, you guys can be posted, and it can be done. You understand what I'm saying? You've got to be very careful mm -hmm. if you're all doing this together right. mm -hmm. that this isn't phone conversations about stuff. I understand that. Yeah. All right. So I, I, I just hate to waste the time that we have here. That's, that's my thing. And I don't have any. The only reason I came to you guys and said tonight was because I thought we'd have a suggestion would have a recommendation from you and being we appoint it and it's done well, i'd like to hear what todd has. evidently he's got some suggestions he can so say it right now tonight. so you've got swiss they're they're they, they're actually running georgetown water right now as well as two others they do it on a regular basis um you have cdm you have aecom um the list on new england water works and mass yeah, water works is you got some is, homework when you get home no, I can make. Well, I can make a couple of phone. Um, <clears throat> I did not realize that that was what was the intent. We were going to thought we were going to talk about it uh, in in what scope, what we were looking for. Are you looking for something similar to like two hours a day, like Tom was, or? That's that's up to you. What so you think is necessary. Well, that's what I thought. You're the I water thought, guys. This is what I thought. I just said we could meet so we could do the appointment, thinking that you guys were going to work on it last week and that's would have it done. That's not how I left the meeting with what I did with my. Okay, so apparently that wasn't understood. So can I say this then? You guys. Do the posting however you want to. You can, if Jim says it's all right to continue a meeting, mm -hmm. I've, I've not done that, okay? My concern in that is, let's say that you decide you're gonna meet Wednesday evening. How does the public know that it's continued to Wednesday evening? On that point, if the water commissioners wanted to continue this meeting to a time certain, they would have to post as soon as is practicable. So it could be tonight, it could be first okay. thing in the morning. So you don't you're not held to it, the forty eight hours. Okay. No, it would be it would be the same. It would be an agenda and instead of saying meeting of, it would say continuation meeting of with the same information on it. And how do we get out of that? Because this is a joint meeting. If you uh, well, even though it's a joint meeting, you're individually posted mm -hmm. as independent boards. If you took a, a vote this evening, tonight, let me even back up. If I understand correctly you don't have an interest in participating in the scope or the who is involved. That's their, that's their, their prerogative. That's right. You only are necessary to execute whatever 
agreement needs to be executed to bring somebody on board. That's right. So if they're going to meet to iron out the scope and the who over the next however many nights, you're just going to be sitting in the wings waiting for them to say who it is and what the contract is so you can sign it. So That's you right. could take a vote this evening and then be done with it. That something along the lines, I make a motion that the select board receive the contract agreement from the Board of Water Commissioners at such time as they've determined term, scope, and the consultant and execute out of session. You can do that and then you're out. They can then Ready? determine what they want. Um, that that makes sense. Okay, and then we can just adjourn our meeting right. and you guys can, they can continue, continue theirs okay. as long and as much as they need. Um, so d would you guys involve like the DEP for assistance they, well, in this as well? Yeah, we can. Um, but I, I mean, I'm just curious. No, you can. But that's that's more of an emergency. Like a, a, you, you'd have. I'm to just own. thinking they might know of someone that's available. Or they, I've asked. They would prefer we do it on our own. Um, okay. So I wouldn't. I don't think we'd probably have an answer tomorrow. But I would think Wednesday or Thursday, if you reach out to some people you know, and between yeah. um, between the engineers I know. We should come up with. We should be able to come up with someone. So your plan is to individually talk. Well, we to know people. different people at different th in different okay, so, circles. So yes. So then you know you have a list of people that you could call. You have a list, then you all get back together and talk through. What do you think, and yes. how are you going to do it, and what so are the hours, and how are you going to work it out? Or yeah. Okay, Nate. So we host a meeting, but we don't need the forty-eight hours. Uh, so we can post a week and change the venue, change the posting location yeah. too. Yeah, yeah. We're um, <coughs> and it's no problem for us if we make that as the motion. That means we're we're giving you the ability to do that, and we will sign it out of session. All right. Okay. Does that make yeah, sense? Sounds good. That sounds good. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Can I can I ask a question? Sure. As, as a resident, do, does the Water Commission have a scope of service that you're going to use to solicit? It's going to be interim superintendent, probably be dependent. Um, did you write something up for Tom when he took? No. That was, actually, Tom, that was, Tom came to me from Mike, so. Yeah. yeah. Um, if it's an interim superintendent, I would, um, I hadn't put it in the words, but you were good. The term interim superintendent means all jobs, duties, and responsibility of a superintendent. Whether you term it as part time, where it's only two hours, of, like Tom was doing two hours a day because he, he has a full time job. Um, Mike and I probably know half a dozen retired superintendents, um, um, and the engineers. I, you know, I'm going to hedge on the on the side of being part time because it can get expensive. Yeah, absolutely. So I don't think they need to be there full time, um, but I definitely think um, you know two or three hours a day for the for the for the for the work hours. Our foreman has all. He's not. We're not asking for a primary operator. His foreman has all the necessary licenses and certifications, um, and there hasn't been a problem with the day to day, as far as I know. So all we're looking for is someone that has the, the, the experience and the know-how to do the, um, the superintendent's admin type stuff jobs. But I thought you also have a couple of jobs happening right now, too, that need to be overseen. We, right? we, in the we last have inspectors week. for them. Yes, we, we full-time oh, inspectors. That's yeah. right. That's on our agenda tomorrow. Yes. Oh, for that contract. That's yes. For, yes. Mm -hmm. And that should cover that. That's going to be, if, if, we, if the superintendent, interim superintendent was going to do that, that would more than likely take up all of his time. So trying work, to separate yeah, those two okay. out. I just yeah. misunderstood that. Yep, that that's okay. Um, all right, let's do it. And, and you don't yeah. have to have like a, a regular posting for a situation like this because it's a little bit more of an emergency kind yeah. of thing, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes? Um, my question is, we did, I mean, everything happens here so fast. Didn't we have a, a temporary water superintendent named? Uh, yeah. Did it, someone filled that position? For a short period and then decided that he is 
concentrate on Groton. And that was his reason for leaving? He gave us notice that he yeah. wasn't going to do it anymore. And that's all? No reason other than that? One of many that leave here and don't tell okay. us why. But uh, okay. That's all. Just anyway, fine. okay, we're all right? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. You with that okay. motion? Yeah. 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 All right. Do it as a team. Well, okay, so your motion? I move that we authorize the Board of Water Commissioners to work together on identifying and securing a contract with the uh, for an interim water superintendent. And assign such agreement and out of session. Agreement out of session. Okay, I'll second that. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. And if you guys just want a, a motion to um, continue this meeting until, did you say Thursday night? Yes. Give you both yeah, a couple days. Yeah, yeah, Thursday night. Yeah, yeah. Give us Thursday a night little. at the water department. Um, um, six good for you. Six. Six okay for you? Sure. All right. Six o'clock Thursday, the 8th. the 8th. Tomorrow is the 6th, 7th, 8th. Yes. I make a motion that we leave continue. open or continue this meeting um, of the Board of Water Commissioners to the Water Commissioner's Office uh, at 6 o'clock on August 8th to discuss in uh, the list of possible candidates for interim superintendent. Somebody want to second that? Second. second. All in favor. Aye. 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 Okay. Thank you. Uh, motion to adjourn. I move that we adjourn at 6:45. Second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. So we would not adjourn our meeting. Correct. That's correct. No one's in. We're all done, sir. That's it. That's it. Thank you.